hi everybody welcome back to the channel what a glorious day today we have 16 degrees finally spring decided to come to Romania as well I need to go to take care of some things in a city nearby and I want to talk to you about my bittersweet experience with uh, the Climb Helmets and the Climb Company in November of 2021 that means last year, a few months ago I ordered online from a local supplier a Climb Carbon Adventure Helmet the one uh, prior to the Krios to the Krios Pro I had a very nice deal it was like I think it's it was right around the Black Friday period and I said this is too good of an opportunity to pass on so I bought it since November until today you know very well my uh, my rides with a motorcycle were fewer than uh, five six rides because it it is uh, winter in Romania and uh, of course immediately after I bought it I uh, installed on it my uh, Senna and later on my GoPro with the microphone and everything that comes with it immediately after the first time that I opened the, the foam the inner foam you know there's a liner inside this liner has some retention clips that attaches to the styrofoam of the helmet when I installed the GoPro immediately one of the clips broke <laughs> it was a very nasty situation but I said okay I still have one but then in the same day the other one broke as well and believe me this is not I'm not a beginner I, I've been handling helmets for a long time I know uh, how important it is to handle them with care but they just broke on me really I, I did not put a lot of pressure and they just broke on me I was very very disappointed and uh, uh, very sad because I couldn't use my helmet anymore as the back of the head the foam from the back of the head couldn't be attached to the to the helmet anymore I found a solution improvising and using some velcro it was a let's say a improvisation but I had to improvise something to, to make it use useful but it was still not uh, manageable not rideable I said okay I, I, I can live with this a little bit until I take a decision what I do with this helmet but then two weeks ago when I did the filming for uh, the trailer when I fixed the trailer one day when I when I took off the clip that holds the strap of the double D broke you know the, the red clip the one from the pictures broke on me that was too much really it, it transformed transformed my helmet into non-usable I could not use the helmet anymore I was so sad very very sad very very and I said oh my god this is one overpriced crap of a helmet that that I've bought and I said okay I was really 
prepared to throw it away and just buy another helmet because uh, I didn't want to go through contacting the local supplier climb and uh, requesting for a warranty I was that upset and I went ahead and ordered online a new helmet I went back to my first love <laughs> next helmets currently is the helmet that I'm using now and I bought a X-WED 2 adventure helmet okay but then one of my friends Gabriel I, I told him the story with this helmet with the climb helmet and he said Dragos but don't write to the local supplier write and complain directly to climb and I say okay what do I have to lose nothing okay let's let's make a complaint to climb and I wrote uh, an email to them explaining the situation attaching some photos immediately I think in few hours uh, somebody from climb contacted contacted me saying okay we need to go through the process we have a process here please uh, follow our process which is displayed on our uh, website and we will see okay being directly interested in this I immediately uh, followed the process which is stated on the website is very simple attached the photos uh, gave the, the, the important information the next day I received an email from climb that uh, a case a warranty case was open and that I should provide a little bit more detailed photos and I did these are the photos that I provided with the defect and of course the purchase uh, information in the same day I think it's hours apart somebody from climb contacted at me again saying okay Dragos it seems that your helmet is unusable anymore we cannot fix your helmet and we will give you a brand new one we will give you another one and uh, you just have to show us the proof that you destroyed your old helmet and I wrote back and I asked okay so I need to destroy the helmet is she said yes cut the chin straps show us the photos and that's it that's all you have to do and I did and I cut the traps and I sent these photos to them and in one day I received the email that the new helmet is on its way to me <laughs> so it was that fast I, I think it's it, so in three days I solved the issue with the helmet now <laughs> what can I say? I, I'm, I'm surprised. I feel, I feel good. It was normal because you know, we are speaking about uh, we are speaking about a premium helmet. I've decided, uh, okay, once in this lifetime, I need to have uh, a premium helmet. Let me give it a try to climb. And you're spending a lot of money, and you're expecting the quality to to be the best, and uh, sometimes it's not. But uh, their customer support is absolutely fabulous, fantastic, very easy, very nice. They explain you each step of the way what to do in case you have a problem. And they solve the issue. I mean, the, the, they send me a new, it's on the way. I did not receive it yet. It's on the way, but they send me a new helmet. Now I have two helmets. I have the x 2, the one that I'm having on right now. And on the way I have the climb. I'll see what I, what I will do about that. Uh, which one I will take on road. Which I will, one I will take off road. I will see. Uh, what I like about uh, x 2 uh, until now. It's, it's a quiet helmet. I, I know very well the, the next helmets. They are very rugged. Very nice. Very well built. And uh, it's a quiet helmet. And more than the climb they have um, the inner sunglasses 
and uh, this is a very big plus for me the climb adventure does not have inner sunglasses so you have to bring with you an extra pair of sunglasses which sometimes can be difficult to wear uh, because it creates pressure points on your head I was prepared to live with that too but I was not expecting that the quality of the uh, clips or the parts inside the helmet to be that bad anyway this is why you buy a premium helmet this is why uh, you buy and you you choose a premium company like climb because of their services and now I feel kind of bad that I did not do it from the beginning that means contacting the, the climb company because uh, I was uh, speaking with uh, with my friend and uh, telling him about this situation it's it's normal Dragos if nobody complains to them they will not have a database with all the problems that the helmet have and uh, to turn to their supplier and to try to fix the issues and for this type of uh, price level it's normal that they behaved in the way they did so thank you climb for taking care of me this well uh, I chose not to say to you anything about having a climb helmet because you know I bought it in November uh, I had no time to test it and I said okay I need more time to properly test this helmet before having a review or initial thoughts so yeah this is my if if you ask me for example now if I would go choose between a medium price helmet and um, a high valued helmet like climb I will still choose the climb helmet or the high value company because of the services because of their warranty services because of their customer support so I think it's worth the money uh, if you can afford it now x uh, this is a carbon version I will have a separate video but as well I need some time to properly test it and for me to in order to me for me to tell you something about it but it's it's also this one is also a premium helmet is not uh, very cheap and uh, I feel good wearing it I will decide I will see how <laughs> How will I manage two helmets? But uh, we will see. Guys, thank you so much for watching my channel. Spring is coming, spring is here already in Romania and uh, we will be going out, me and my motorcycles will be going out, out more and more creating more content for content for this small channel until next time please ride safe and uh, yeah see you next time ciao